Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to do uh, an unboxing as you can see. It's Glock 17 Gen 5 that was released only in December of 2023. It's 2024 January by Tokyo Marui. So it's a gas blowback. So it's the first one I'm uh, buying which is a gas blowback. So let's have a look uh, of what uh, it is. A uh, special uh, shout out to Sector 5 Kyoto uh, that allowed me to shoot here uh, and also to record uh, because we're gonna go through some uh, shooting and see how it works. Okay, so without further ado. So the box itself is really, really nicely done. There's a, like a ripped finish here. So, okay. Experience the Tokyo Marui. So let's just, oh. And here is the, the <laughs> pardon me, here is the, uh, the actual uh, thing. So, uh, as you can see, it's Glock Gen 5. And it's a very, very nice, nice replica. So, before we start uh, playing with this, let's have a look what we have here. Of a bit of a, a user manual here. So let's take it out. Uh, there is some safety. Uh, there is a cap here that you need to be uh, putting in. So yeah, and then is just some rules and warnings. So we're going to put it over here. <laughs> Airsoft gun. What are you not supposed to be doing? So, uh, as you basically can see, uh, so you also need to uh, follow the rules and things like that. So, obviously, no drive by shooting. It's pretty self explanatory. Just be careful. There's a target here. Probably gonna set it up and see what we have. And uh, uh, some warnings and how to assemble uh, okay, the gun or toy. Then we have uh, some of the, how it's made and things like that. Which parts to order if I need to. And the price as well. It's funny because the price doesn't change then in Tokyo Marui or they don't expect uh, people to use them too long. How to do returns, what to, how to order new prices, uh, new, new parts and things like that. Every part is named. It's a very, very thorough uh, explanation. So should anything go bust, we'll be able to order them. And the uh, the actual uh, guide book, guide book, Torisetsu, is in how to use this. Uh, so yeah, there are some warnings. I mean, they're pretty self-explanatory. So always wear eye protection and things like that. We have some of the uh, uh, things that what's in the box as well. We're going to explore it a little bit So obviously you need to read it before you start using uh, this particular uh, gas blowback Just leave it here And now the the actual thing. So what we have in the box we have some uh, additional uh, grip uh, grip Enhancers in a sense because if you have large hands, this is what you've been doing This is the gas blowback so, you see, there's a warning. Let's take it off. Thank you very much. I'll throw it away in a rubbish bin. So, like this is the gas blowback. There is the hop-up unit right there. Uh, that's, the, that's the safety. The magazine release is right here. And the slide release. So, I guess we just need to put the it's a nice weight to it as well. You need to put the, um, the magazine inside, cock it, and that's what we have. So the slide is off because it's empty. So basically what happens once the magazine is empty, uh, it will uh, do what the real uh, Glock and other handguns do. This variety, it will lock here and to release it, go like this. What you don't, you, you shouldn't be doing is releasing it without, uh, without controlling it. But let's do it once. There you go. Nice weight to it as well. 
uh, and uh, basically it has a number of uh, safeties. So the first safety is right here. Um, the, the safety is right here and uh, it's so if you try to press it, well, I try to pull the trigger from the side, it doesn't work. And then if you do by uh, pressing this button, well, this lever and the trigger itself, it's now locked into safety. You can't use it. And uh, now it's pretty much take the magazine out. We need to make sure that nothing is in there and it's safe for storage. But we're not gonna bother with this because we're gonna try it out today. So that's the inside, that's what it looks like. Um, I'm left-handed, so it's very uh, helpful for me to have the release here as well on the, on the right-hand side because obviously um, uh, when I use it uh, in game, um, I would be uh, I would be using it here. Unfortunately, the magazine release is still on the right side, but it's not too much for too big of a deal. So first, we have our Glock here and the magazine. Then we have those grip. Uh, enhancers they have uh, they come in a number of different sizes and also types there is a longer one and there is a shorter one so it's uh, it's called the back strap so we have uh, medium and large and medium and large I'm probably gonna do I'm gonna probably enhance it with um, medium because I have fairly large palms but we'll see how we go then obviously a little bit of a box here Open it up and see what we have. So yeah, I had the real, uh, real good Japanese quality. Everything is well packed. There's a cap here. I will be using that. Uh, then there's some spare parts. Uh, those are uh, Neji uh, uh, bolts that we can use to secure certain things. Uh, we have a um, like a rod here in order to open the magazine. I've never done it so let's have a look how it's done. So in previous versions um, the uh, the gas insert uh, button is uh, exposed and in this one it's not so we need to slide it and there we are here it is we're gonna try and do it today but yeah so and then once you've done filling it with gas <laughs> We need to put it back in. I'll figure it out. Okay, so next uh, we have uh, it's uh, going into the magazine inside here. It's a replacement. It's really well done as well. And that's oh, there's a cleaning rod as well. Oh, actually, let's open it up a little further. Yes. The cleaning rod is right here. So it's just to clean the barrel, should there be any stoppages and things like that. Very useful tool. So, quite happy with this. I'm gonna see how it works. I'm gonna figure out how to put this in uh, because it's, again, it's the first time I am doing it. And then we'll go play. Okay, I managed to uh, figure it out. So basically there is a, yep, so it's just, uh, uh, shows me that I should read those things. Uh, so all we have to do is slide this lock down and it closes like magic and then it locks it in place. So let's charge it with um, with our uh, little, you can actually open it uh, this way as well. I'm gonna charge it with our gas. Today I'm using this particular gas, but it doesn't really matter. Any type of green gas would be nice. I'm not gonna fill it up to the top because all I want to do is just check it out and test it. So, go like this. Then I'm gonna load it with BBs and we're gonna start shooting. All right, and then we're gonna try and uh, uh, see how it works with uh, MP5. Uh, then we switch once we run out of ammunition. Uh, we switch to uh, the Glock.
pretty good. Uh, some targets were not hit, but I'm still getting used to this. But it's really, really nice. Now we're going to do something a little bit different. Uh, we're going to shoot uh, those targets over there. Uh, and uh, it's five, five targets, and once you hit one, uh, it starts spinning because of the weight distribution. And I'm going to be doing it with Tokyo Marui Gen 5 Glock 17. Let's try it. It's empty. What a failure. But it was really nice. I'm gonna try again. 